Hey guys, it's Hamza with another crypto video. Assalamu alaikum and welcome to my channel where we're discussing NFTs all the time because that's where the trend is. One of my favorite projects in the NFT world is Galactic Apes. And I've discussed this a while ago, but I'm discussing it again because I love this project so much and there's so much room for this project to grow. So with that, let's get to it. All right, guys, so the project I'm discussing today is Galactic Apes. I love this project for so many reasons. Number one, these Galactic Apes look so sexy. I love, I love, I love the art on these Galactic Apes. Check these out. I mean, uh, look, look at the art. Look at that. This is really, really nice art. I mean, they're they're sexy pixelated apes i i can't say any more than the than that really um look at that the colors the the resolution the properties the traits everything is so sexy with these uh with these apes all right so the reason why i love uh this project so much is because the dev his name is wes and wes was an OG Cyberkongs. He understands the NFT market. He's been in the NFT market space for so long. And he joined Cyberkongs when Cyberkongs was really cheap. Anybody that joined Cyberkongs um, earlier this year, he gets like one of the, the highest, uh, you know, respect from me because that's one of the best projects in the NFT space. I'm a Cyberkong fan myself. I do own a baby Cyberkong, so. Uh, anybody that has an OG Genesis Cyber Kong and is creating their own project to, you know, replicate the success. I'm a big fan. And I mean, look at this. This is amazing. All right. This we're just looking from the outside. Now we're going di to dissect the inside. All right. So what are Galactic Apes? Galactic Apes started off with Genesis, just like um, the Genesis uh, Cyber Kong. So let's look at the Genesis Cyber Kongs. And yes, you're looking at the correct price floor. They're at 85 Ethereum. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, guys. They're at 85 Ethereum price floor. This was like five Ethereum floor like two or three weeks ago. But they 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 went up, you know, the floor goes up so high because there's only 151 of these Genesis apes. I mean, look at these. Look at this. Look at this. Uh, they're all one of ones, all right? each genesis uh galactic ape is a one of one all right so you can never find the same trait with another one i mean these look these guys they're animated some of them are not animated but these guys are so 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 sick i mean uh, i'm priced out of genesis but <coughs> the galactic apes i am not priced out all right so what are these, Hamza? What, what do they do? So the main reason for the, these galactic apes is they're going to go on missions, all right? And if you go follow their Discord, which I'm going to leave a link below, there is so much clues that Wes is leaving us. We have no idea what the missions do, but we have an idea that there is missions, and he explains to us on the Discord. So if you go on the Discord and you go to frequently, frequently, frequently asked questions, you can see the official links and you can see the roadmap as well. All right. So I'm not going to discuss the roadmap. I'm not going to discuss the uh, official links. I'm going to discuss what's known so far. So we know there is a game and the game has missions. And for the missions, you need apes. Right. So right here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to skip all of this because I just told you this. Uh, what are missions? Missions are gamification mechanism for the galactic apes universe with your crew or crews you will be able to complete missions that yield other NFTs and rewards. So what we understand from here is that um, these galactic apes are going to go on a mission and you're going to yield NFTs and rewards. And with rewards, what I'm thinking is we're going to yield some kind of token that Wes is working on. Why do I think it's a token? Because Wes um is is basing his project on cyber kongs and cyber kongs has genesis right they have a thousand genesis and they have baby kongs and they have cyber kongs vx well wes didn't copy it uh like straight up 
but he did replicate some of the aspect of the Genesis and some of it with the galactic apes themselves. All right. What will you need? Uh, will I need more than one ape to run missions? Yes. For missions, you will need a crew, but you can also have multiple crews to run different missions simultaneously. All right. Depending on your crew mix, there will be significant advantages over other crews. All right. So what are the best crews mix to have? The three types of... Uh, uh, the the three crew types from most to least advantages will be three galactic apes with a total of each of one Guinness. So what does that mean? So you need three galactic apes and all, all three of them need to be a, a, a different type, right? So uh, if we go to, if we go right here and, and, and let's just click on this one. All right. So um, if you look at properties and you look at uh, what kind of, uh, you know, ape it is, it's a orangutan, all right? So you need one orangutan, you need one chimpanzee, and you need one gorilla, all right? And how do I know that? Well, if you go back right here and you go to uh, uh, the type of ape, or is, is it Guinness or Genus? I'm, I'm not sure. I, I'm not sure. Um, but uh, you need one gorilla, one chimpanzee, and one orangutan to have the best crew, all right? That will be the best crew to have. All right. So if we go back to Discord, it says three galactic apes with one of each type. All right. The second one, which will be more, uh, which would be uh, second, uh, the, the second one to be advantageous, right, will be three total apes with any total mix. So it could be two orangutans, one chimp, so on and so forth. And then though you can run a mission with two galactic apes with any mix all right pretty understandable now he keeps dropping like i said clues in the galactic apes uh twitter as you can see right here i don't understand this i've tried to ask questions on the discord but nobody knows yet um it's all speculation so remember these numbers at genesis all right is gonna have 0.5 now what is this 0.5 means I've asked in the Discord, and some people said that it's going to take half a day. Some people is saying it's going to take half of, 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 of a charge, right? So a Genesis would be the most charged, and it'll only take him half of the charge. He's going to have, like, what I'm thinking, he's going to have an energy level, and it's only going to take half of his energy, right? Because the three um, Genesis, Genesis, I guess Genesis crew, is going to take two energy three ape crew will have will take four energy and two ape crew will take eight energy and what's really cool what's what i really love about the project as well is that if you don't have time to do these mission missions aka me i have like six or seven galactic apes right i'm not gonna play the game just because i am busy i have a daytime job i have youtube and i have a community to follow up with I'm not going to be able to run the game. The game might take, you know, three, four hours or an hour or two, whatever it is. What you can do is you can take one ape and you can uh, set up a price and they can, uh, people can, can pay you a bounty or some kind of money and they can, um, you know, they can uh, rent out a, a crew from you, right? So this is a better explanation, right? Let's just say I have a galactic ape and uh, I, I'm not going to do any missions. And you have two and you want one more for uh, a mission to run. You can rent my galactic ape. And you're going to pay me a bounty or a fee to the ape owner, which is me. And you can rent my ape for a mission. I win. You win. We both win in this situation to run the mission, which is really awesome. Nobody's really doing that. Um, the only one that's really doing that that's, that comes close to it is Axie Infinity. All right. So um, Wes is an awesome guy. He keeps dropping announcement every single day about missions, about what Genesis is going to do, what your ape crew is going to do. Like right here on September 30th, which is five days ago, he said missions will have a fixed supply varying, varying from mission to mission. Each run from a crew will be rewarded one supply. We don't know what the supply is. It could be a yield token. It could be a rewards to get more um more apes, I guess. I, I I have no idea. Once total supply is depleted, the mission will end. That's what I'm saying. 
the supply is depleted and Genesis takes 0.5 of that supply, I don't know. It, I don't know. I don't know. I, I, it, it's just, it's going to tie, it's all going to, you know, make sense at the end of the day. But I, I, there's a lot of speculation, right? Uh, crew members can be hired out uh, to run complete runs. And, and I've just explained that to you guys. All right. So uh, two days ago, he said Galactic's, Galactic Monkeys will support crew. Guys, we are at 2.35 Ethereum floor. Um, for some of you, you are priced out. For the people who are not priced out, I really recommend getting, getting you one because you're going to get a free monkey. All right. Monkeys are, uh, you know, are important to the crew, as he says here. Look, look, monkeys can be added to a full crew to complete missions more efficiently. There are seven different monkeys. Monkeys can be hired out for a fee paid to the monkey NFT owner. For each ape you hold, you will be able to mint one monkey. So I will get a free mint of one monkey. And since I have six or seven galactic apes, these are I'm going to mint six or seven monkeys. So in the future, we're going to have more galactic apes. Is The supply will increase from 10,000 uh, items to 20,000. And we will have 10,000 monkeys. So in total, supply is going to be 20,000 to run these missions. This is a perfect example for... Uh, an NFT to have a game, to have reward, and to have fun, even if you're owner, if, even if you're a holder. It's a win-win-win situation for everybody. Um, if, if we go to the volume trade and we see, look, <laughs> looking at the graph, I did buy at 0.385, but it steadily keeps climbing up. More holders and more owners are coming into the galactic ape space. Um, I really love the projects. You guys knew... Uh, you guys uh, know that I was a CyberKongs fan like two months ago when I made this video. And they were about 2.34 Ethereum when I talked about baby Kongs. If we go, uh, if we go to CyberKongs, right? <clears throat> CyberKongs uh, page, we, we can see that, you know, it's like 6x from here. Um, I expect the same things with Galactic Apes. Just because of the utility, just because of the dev. He keeps making an announcement. Wes is an awesome guy. I really love this project. All right, guys. That's it for my Galactic Apes video. If you really do like my content, hit the like button below and subscribe. It's your boy, Hamza Al-Asfar, and assalamu alaikum.